So here they are, the runners-up in World Juniors this year. Competing in their first World Championships. Gave a really good account of themselves in the short. Can they back it up here? 18-year-old Julien Seguin and 21-year-old Charlie Billadeau for Canada. Music from Peter Gabriel. Excellent start, triple salcos. Perfectly synchronized. Slightly awkward on the catch, but round okay. Triple twist. Difficult choreography in the entry to that. Hand to the hip, that's a group three lift. Reversing the rotation. It's a good level that. Strong. Entry into the lift. Single arm, well done. Double toes again, timing perfect. Pro triple Salco. Red Eagle on the takeoff for the lift, making it difficult, changing position within it, lots of content, and the stop at the end. That'll get a good mark. <laughs> Two magnificent throw jumps, Sarko and Tolu. Just 
great to see. For me, comfortably the best routine we've had so far, although the technical mark at the moment is languishing behind Dastakova and Roganoff, but boy, oh boy, are they going to be a couple for the future. First World Championships, and they looked as if they really enjoyed it, and they gave so much enjoyment to everybody watching. Well, yes, what a great skate they've had. Just super, from the opening triple Sarkaz through, all the lifts were difficult there. And uh, the spins, fast in those spins, with great unison in them as well. So ticking a lot of the, the buttons for me, not as strong over the ice as the Russians, and as well the, the expression that the Russians have and the power um, will definitely, to me, give them the edge overall. But I'm, it's the first time I've seen these two skate. And, the, and it's just ticking the boxes again and again. The, yeah. the Joe Triple Toe loop right at the death of the program shows the confidence they have and her ability in the, the, in the jumps department. She's just delivering and delivering that throw triple Sarko. She landed it with ease. It's like, oh, I could do a quad one of those. And indeed, some of the couples are going for that. And you feel there's so much more to come from these two as well. Yes. So much scope. Like to see so Great choice of music. Very well portrayed on the ice. Rock solid. Slightly awkward landing there to the triple twist. It's difficult the entry into that. The place you are. Here, she, she landed. High and easy. But all my instincts There's a bit of development to go. And the grand and Charlie's so arms. Some, sometimes the the hand eyes, positions a little without bit more of a softening. Eyes, all that will come. But when, you know when you've got people in your country that are competing, and in your nationals you're competing against people at the top of the world, it makes you just look at that as being the benchmark. And it lifts you up, and that's what we're seeing here. It's great. Have they got enough of a cushion over the Russians? They are possibly, maybe probably, going to be beaten on the free. They have five points to spare from the short program. They may need all those five. Astakova and Roganov getting 118. They are OK. Just beaten on the free, but overall, they've held on to top spot at the moment. Very, very well done, Seguin and Bilodeau.